Hello and welcome, I'm Marumba. thank you for joining me. We're in episode number 17 of Let's Play Proper Portugal. So we're expanding properly. We've got four colonies, two colonists. And, uh, I think that, you know what we could really do to be, like, crazy with colonization? Would actually be to potentially unlock another diplomatic idea and go with expansion ideas. More colonists, merchants, lowers colonists' travel time. It would be pretty powerful. And we'd able to be able to tack around into the less advanced nations in Asia. On the other hand, we're still getting really far ahead on military tech, so I might need to do a military idea group first. Or just continue to stay really far ahead on military tech. Overall, though, I think you're probably better off having a balance between them, as far as efficiency goes. Okay, how about you guys? Where do we, where do we need to murder people? We need to continue clearing out this area. Here, chop these guys off. Let's pick up these guys. Who are... They have the Conquistador, and we're gonna kinda kill the rest of these people. Kinda. Kinda, kinda. By kill, kind of, I mean kill all of them, of course. 500 poor souls. Goodbye. <laughs> that is great news, it says. Did we, did we do it? Oh, well, that's interesting. So, it'll allow you to do that, but we can't actually fight them because we have the black flag. It's kind of a buggy thing, I think. So we've got to retreat to our own land. Grab the same guy, and now we should be able to do it. Because now we don't have the black flag anymore. There we go. Okay, so we'll try again. Much better. <laughs> Die! Kill the natives! All of them. Here's see Spartacus. The beginning of the, uh, the very beginning of it, like the very first episode. His wife tells him in a dream, kill them all. Yes, kill them all. Another island up here we need to purge. Why can't we go there? Oh, obviously. We're in the wrong sea zone. I know how to play this game, swear. I swear, sometimes I do. Okay, are we getting money from this one yet? Yeah, we're getting five point something. I think he's way better off being out here. We've kind of given up some of our power in the Sevilla trade node, but when we look at income, I don't know, I still think it's going up. I think it's a good idea. What we really need is we could use some more ships. And even though I like the idea of having a good balance, uh, we're not going to. We're just going to make trade ships like crazy. We need to make three more of them. More barks. Truce with Mali is over next. Same thing with Congo and Tunisia. So we could attack the Congo soon. Two more years. Take their money. What are you doing, Bark? Why aren't you, uh, why aren't you busy? What's your deal? Didn't I tell you to do something? Doo -doo. Well, we've got this one in the coast. Uh, it's protecting trade in the Caribbean. This one's doing nothing. This one's protecting Brazil. Chesapeake Bay. How about you patrol... Whatever this trade note's called. Can we do Congo? Yeah, go patrol Congo just to keep it from pirates. Free of pirates. Makes sense to me. Kind of. Yes, it's part of our patrimony. So we can convert this culture. Oh, that's so cheap. Wow. Same religion overseas? I love it. Let's, uh, let's do it. Let's go to the accepted cultures map mode for a second, see if there's anything else we can convert. This one? No, I've got to missionarize it first. Okay. 
I really want to get this one soon, because I'm still kind of worried. I think it was France that did pick up expansion ideas. Exploration ideas. They're at level 3. Ugh. Okay, um... It's five years of lower production efficiency. Most of our income's coming from trade, and I, I, I want to keep inflation down. I think that we need to do that. So if France were to start expanding, they would do it... there. That's their only launching point. This one's too far away, definitely. This one's closer. So we need to take this one, like, right away. Uh, revolt risk is down. Let's go get ready to camp out there then and uh, colonists got people there darn it I need both of them really we should take our troops down there it's just one island right okay Did we get this thing who's this thing it's all part of the same island Part of that one. Okay, and then we have an unexplored island there. <laughs> I so, I don't know. I I say it almost every time. But I just feel so terrible. It's like we just show up and kill stuff. I'm just like, oh hey guys, how's it going? Yeah, nice island you have here. Blah, dead. I mean, this one's going to become something soon, so I guess we don't really need to kill the natives. I, I, you know, we could probably wait. We can wait, like, a year. It's not even going to be a year, not with him working on it. So let's check these again. So we've killed the natives. Killed the natives. Natives. That's already a colony. No natives. None, none. None, none. Natives. Hey, now. Puerto Rico. Fur. Ooh, nice. That's a good one. Nice. Another core. I am liking it. This is going pretty well. Um, hmm. We'll do these three, and then we'll just continue around. So I think we already did all these. We've pretty much purged the Caribbean. And next we'll probably go along this coast. Yes, yes, we could get more income and stuff if we didn't kill everyone. But that makes colonization tough. Our traditional fisheries are proving excellent grounds. Nice. No new mission. And it looks like that colony is about to pop. A bailiff in one of our provinces has earned a reputation as a greedy and cruel person. We'll lose the stability because I... Or sorry, the prestige because I want my stability. And there's our colony. Perfect. Let's core it. Our colonist is now returned home. Let's send him to here. And as soon as he gets there, which will be in 51 days, we'll move these troops, exterminate the natives. I don't really care about the base tax income. I just... I just well, never mind. If we've got the troops there, we'll leave them. They're here anyway. We need them for, to protect against uh, rebellions in this sector. So, and that way, uh, I don't think France can get anywhere. I mean, this one is owned by. Um, Spain. This is all owned by Morocco. So there's like, you know, there's no no landing point really. They could try to land here, or anywhere along this coast, and then up here again. So I think we're gonna be able to knock them out. It's gonna work. It's gonna work. I'm so excited. Um, almost ready for another administrative tech point, or idea group. Sorry, which will be the debt and loans thing. We don't have any interest rate. No loans right now, so... But that'll get us closer to the merchant, which will be good. Any different advisors? 
Yeah, yearly inflation reduction. I feel like I don't have anything to spend my money on right now. I mean, even at four or five colonies, we're still maintaining a... Actually, we're maintaining... Almost maintaining four colonies without losing money. With full morale, so... I think I will consider upping my... guy to level three. Yeah, let's do it. We'll take the yearly inflation reduction. He's a lot more money. Costs 229 up front and 14 a month, but that'll give us more administrative power as well, so we'll be able to get that idea group capped out quickly. No, England. Never. It's not gonna happen. You guys are doing what? Do we want to kill the natives here? Who we'll kill the natives? Did you guys kill the natives yet? Kill them. And since this one is a low income province and I'm just blocking with it, I don't really want my guy there. I want him to be somewhere that's high income. That one's already covered. Let's just keep doing the, uh, what? Should we do this one? Because this one will end up giving us more more trade power in this node. And I could still use more trade power. We only have a 61% share. But then again, um, settling this one will just, hmm. Let's keep doing the Caribbean. Everyone everyone knows this is a great one. It's just a great spot. Lots of high income. It'll be our fifth one, so it's going to be super, super expensive, but who cares? It's not my problem. New idea group. I like it. I want that merchant. Another possible advisor would be great, too. And this thing's growing fast. An alliance offer from France. Um, I thought we were already allied. Why did you unally me? Uh, no, you're going to get involved in too many wars. I don't want to do that. Now, Spain here has taken exploration ideas. So we need to block them off too. So that's going to be getting the rest of this. Probably start to take these two as well. It's tough to block everyone, man. Maybe we should just attack Spain. Start backstabbing them. There's that fifth colony, so now we're at negative 55 a month. Can You can only support that for a couple of years, but these colonies should be done before those two years are up. And if we get low on money again, I'll just not do five at a time. Looks like our truce is over with Mali and Congo. So let's look at them. They've got just 168. Mali has money, though. We have no Cassus Belli right now. I should probably fabricate a claim. On Bambuk, sure. It's going to take a couple years. I should have started that a while ago. So let's make sure we have one in Congo as well. Oh well. Not 100% optimal. This isn't like a, a speed run or anything, you know, where you never make a mistake and you do that. Um, kill the natives. Let's go to Jamaica. Jamaica, man. Kill the natives. Of course, killing the natives might even make it easier for Alliance, the uh, the other characters, the AI, to expand. Because they won't have to have any troops really to worry about. And we're so close. We need four more national ideas to get royal absolutism. Unfortunately, there are not four more in here. We're going to need to get 1,200 administrative power to finish off economic ideas. And then we need 
to get to level 10 administrative tech. So it's going to take a ton of administrative technology before we can actually do that. Hmm. I feel pretty good about where we're at over here for now. I think I'm going to send these conquistador, this guy, over to Mali. And we'll use him to attack. A couple years away, but... And they have... They did westernize, if you remember. What's that little... Outraged. They may form the backbone of a coalition. Hmm. Well, I think you're outraged. You're outrageous. that missionary not done yet? Come on. Oh, he is done. I knew that. Wolof. We'll do... Wolof. I know the other one's quicker, but it's down here, and I don't want to... It's over here. Don't want to deal with it. It's too far away. Okay, got our troops, and we're reinforcing. We're capped out on manpower. Should we make a couple more men? Probably. Two more? Let's make a couple more guns. Because we tend to fight weak people, and I just like to siege quickly. Yeah, that, that treasury thing is going to need to stop soon. There's a pirate up here. Hmm. 23% chance, or should we recall him and send him to one of the colonies that's almost finished, like this one? Yeah. Let's get that finished. That'll help out quite a bit, because I think this one, St. Kitts, is probably one of the ones that's really expensive. Actually, no, it's not. But still, it'll knock Guadalupe down from the 900%. And this one should be done very quickly, within a year. Diplotech. Trade range, trade efficiency, I like it. That means that maybe, maybe. Can you hear that thunder? It's just this rolling thunder in the background. Can we, can we now babysit Mexico? Nope. Can we send our guy here? We could. I mean, there's two wealth here. We could take that wealth and steer it into the Caribbean. But then again, the Caribbean is not really doing anything specific. Yeah, I guess it doesn't really matter, does it? Go back to... Brazil. Whatever. Just spread out a bit. You know, kind of protect them all. Got... Oh yeah, that's right. We built some more barks over here. You guys work on the Sevilla trade node. During a recent jousting tournament, an unheralded commoner surprised all in attendance by besting everyone who faced him. Gain a ton of tradition, lose prestige and legitimacy. Or gain legitimacy. Well, we're capped on legitimacy, so I guess we're going to do this one. That is a lot of tradition. Right now we are at 40. Where's the 100 tradition? It said gain a hundred. Did it not? Hmm. Iron Man needs Steam Cloud enabled and user to be logged in on Steam. I am online. Are you talking about Iron Man mode? Might be my, uh, might be that thunder in the background or something. Well, I guess it's a good time to take a break, just in case my saves get messed up. Um, refresh. I am online. Yeah. Okay, we'll take a little break here. I'll see you again soon. Thanks for watching. See you soon.